Ron Reslow, Bowhunter Planet. Uh, I haven't always been a hunter, obviously. I uh, didn't get into hunting until I was like 15. Most people, it's like a, a heritage with their family and everything like that. And I just got into with a group of my friends from high school. And always as a kid, I would see people driving down the road with deer on the back of their cars and always was interested in it. And my, uh, my whole family is tree huggers, more or less. So I ended up meeting uh, my buddy Jay, Jason Dumas, in high school. And he was shooting his bow in his backyard. And I started shooting with him. I actually dry fired his bow the first time drawing it back because I didn't know that you weren't supposed to do that because I was never around hunting at all. But ever since then I've been uh, hunting and learning from friends. I didn't have a dad or an uncle or anything like that to teach me. I just learned through my friends and been hunting state land, been hunting farms, been hunting urban areas and by far the urban, hunt, urban hunting, I'd say, was the most difficult and challenging because the deer are highly pressured and hunted a lot. And you can have just something as simple as a four-wheeler going by screwing up your hunt or someone walking a dog or who knows, just someone changing a flat tire on the side of the road. There's just so many things that happen. I learned a lot of my strategies from hunting uh, state land, urban lots, and people always say, oh, you're lucky, you're lucky, you get one every year. But it's not luck. I mean, I put in so much time. I probably put in 150 hours a year at least. I've worked with Ron since the start of Boner Planet. And I can't tell you how amazing of a hunter Ron really is. A lot of times people underestimate, like, people that are not on TV. But I, I assure you, Ron is pretty much the hardest hunter I've ever met in my life. Not only is Ron a great hunter, but he's a great strategist. He really thinks about what he's going to do, his next move, where he's going to hunt how he's going to do it, what's the deer patterns in the area. Then he plants the food, he puts the stands up, he works the land, he creates the funnels. I mean, he's not just a normal hunter. He's a person who is dedicated to bow hunting and a person who gets it done in a positive way. If I could leave people with just one thing, when you go home and you don't feel like going out, and you feel like, ah, I don't think I'll, I'll wait today, maybe I won't go, Ron's in the woods. People like to say that he gets lucky. He doesn't get lucky. He's out there. He's getting it done. Um, he's always been a positive role model in my mind and one of the best assets we have to uh, growing the archery heritage. Ron Reslow is truly what bow hunting is all about.